Off of Commonwealth Avenue in Boston, it's Patriot League Lacrosse at Nickerson Field as the Terriers, the defending champions of the Patriot League of Boston University, take on the Mountain Hawks of Lehigh on Senior Day. That overtime victory with the game winner from Bork as we get our first goal of the match. Working towards the goal, and they've got it. W, and you know, BU really showed up last year, showed that they can compete. D'Alto gets it back. And they've lost to him so often, and then for them to come back after this game. Oh, what a goal there from Vince D'Alto. They know we just come off a title win with a lot of the same players back. In front, Terriers score again. Terriers working on offense. This is Perfetto. Inside, shot, and another goal for the Terriers. Timmy Lay with a beautiful finish. If Lehigh can score on this possession, they're going to have some momentum. And they get it right there. Big time goal, John Sidorski. Lehigh's moving the ball much better now. I'm up empty on that shot. Ball and loose in front. Oh, wow, what a save there. A shot from point blank range, and coming up with it was Matt Garber. Excellent play from the goalkeeper, Matt Garber. The physical play continues down low. You cannot be timid when you're down there in front of the crease. Garber with the save. BU in the white, Lehigh in the brown. BU on the attack, looking to respond. And they score quickly right off the bat. Off world and just about what he likes about Sisselberger. He's coached him for such a long period of time. And just like that, Lehigh responds to the Alta. Look in front. Oh, what a collision there. And another goal for the Terriers. That, sitting on the side for the next 30 seconds. There's a shot from just outside the crease on the right side. Sidorski, there's another shot and another goal here for Lehigh as they're closing the gap. You know, Coach Cassis says it's a job that he just earned from the end of last season to this one as the Terriers come back and they finally respond here in the third with a goal. Standing here on the man up, Terriers looking to get a shot here. Perfetto, look at in front. Towards the goal, what a shot, what a setup there from Perfetto. Sidorski, working back in the net, Mule. Firing from distance and scoring. Both teams with one loss in Patriot League play. Terriers on the man up, firing and scoring is Jake Cates. You've, you've had three quarters to try to give it a shot, try to score a lot one-on-one. -on -one. Another save in front and off of the rebound, Justin Tiernan. Up top, in front, and scored! Mountain Hawks with 45 on the shot clock, and they get another goal! One from the Terriers, 30 seconds left on the man up, and right in front! The inside ball is loose, and BU trying to grab the ground ball, Lehigh able to grab it, and wide open in front of the net, and able to get a goal! Right in front! But you cannot turn it over, so... Keep it, keep it hot, keep it moving. Oh, right in front, what a pass there. We talked about Perfetto. Gorgeous trophy case inside their locker room. And in front, BU puts this one on ice. Lehigh trying to get a goal here at the end of this one, and they do. And if it's anything like these most recent games have been, I'd like to see it. Would love to see it. The semifinals and championship will be here on CBS Sports Network as Boston University picks up their third consecutive win against Lehigh as they win it 14 to 11. Three goals, four assists today. Lewis, what a game for you guys today. We know that both these teams had this game circled on the calendar. How important was it to get out to a good start, build some separation, knowing that Lehigh wasn't going anywhere? Yeah, I mean, it was really important. I was part of our game plan. It was got to an early start all week. Um, we really need to get jumping our foot um, early on. Um, and it came down, it always comes down to the ground balls and wing play for us, and I thought we did pretty well on that today um, and tried to dominate possession. Uh, Lehigh, I'm pretty sure, was like number one in the country in uh, time of possession, so that was going to be key and to execute when we got our opportunities. So. I thought we did a great job that today. The energy was awesome being at home on, the, on Nickerson Field, uh, senior day. It's everything you can ask for. It had playoff, uh, playoff game experience and environment, so uh, it was awesome. It was really fun to be a part of. You know, it seemed like 
as the game was going along, you all were just getting more and more comfortable with the things that you were trying to do. And it seemed like that was frustrating Lehigh just a little bit. Did you notice that? Could you feel that a little bit on the field? Yeah, no doubt. Um, I think as the game goes, I, mean, I think everyone gets a little silo and everyone gets comfortable. Um, it was awesome to have Jay Cates on 42 back today. He's such a weapon for us. Um, really stretches out the field. So, I mean, they wanted to pressure us. So our motto is be pressure with pressure. Um, so that's what we tried to do. We tried to just stick to our principles and what we're best at, play as a team. Um, and when we played together as a group, we're one of the best in the country. So that's kind of what we tried to do there. Lewis, I know this game just ended here, but you've got a date next week against Army, looking to win a second consecutive regular season title in the Patriot League. You guys had a couple of hiccups a, a few weeks ago. How focused is this team right now going into next week? Yeah, no doubt. I think uh, since I've been here, I'm a senior now, so the, all four years we've dealt with a lot of adversity, whether it's on or off the field, and I think, honestly, that's just made us stronger as a group, and I think it's given us a whole lot of experience, and I think that the adversity earlier in the year only makes us stronger as a group, and we learn from that. Those are all learning experiences for us, um, and I think that's why we were able to pull one out this week. We pulled a, a good one out at home against Loyola last week, so... Um, it's been crucial for us. We're a really senior heavy group. We got a lot of experience and we don't want to let it go to waste. So we're going to keep getting everything we got and uh, learn from our failures and learn from our experiences so far just uh, to get uh, our best foot forward next week. Well, Lewis, congratulations on getting the victory here in front of the home fans at Nickerson Field. Go enjoy it. Thank you so much, guys. Have a good day. You too. That's Lewis Perfetto. Uh, big time victory. Three goals, four assists in the game for him. Again, last year's Patriot League Tournament MVP. Again, Alex Zobario, Ron Warren, glad to have you with us here on CBS Sports Network. A big victory for the Boston University Terriers, winning at 14-11 to over Lehigh, taking over sole possession of second place here in the Patriot League as head coach Ryan Pauly joins us now on the field. And coach, we've been talking about this and how you guys were the hunted now going into this season. And here you guys are at home at Nickerson Field being able to face off against a Lehigh team that certainly had this game circled in scarlet red on their calendars. And you guys got off to a great start. Tell us about how the game looked to your eyes. Um, you know, first of all, I'll just give Lehigh a ton of credit. I mean, they're so good. I mean, it starts at the X, and they just play so hard. They, Every time we tried to stress the lead out, they made plays and cut into it. But, you know, credit to our guys for, you know, every time that they made a play, we, we made one a little bit better. So, you know, the seniors, it was great on senior day. A lot of seniors stepped up and made plays. It was great to see Garber, you know, play. He's not a senior, but to play like a fifth year and, it was just really exciting. I mean, we've been trying to put a complete game together, and I think we're, we're closer. Did great against uh, Loyola, and then uh, responded great against Lehigh. You know, uh, you don't get a chance to really enjoy this win too much because uh, forward focus, you have Army coming up next week. What is it that you need to be very mindful of when you're playing a team like Army? Uh, they're just so well coached. So if you make mistakes, they typically capitalize. So if you're not on your game offensively, they shut you down. If you have breakdowns on defense, they score. You know, they're great at the X. Um, you know, well coached in a riding and clearing game. So, you know, they, they really don't have a weakness. And, um, you know, it's, it's going to be a battle. So we'll, we'll be excited to see the result between them and Navy, see what, see what, what happens, and then go up there and, uh, you know, give it our best. Ryan, tell us about uh, the, this line of yours, your attack line, this Long Island Express, and how good they were today for you guys. Yeah, I mean, starting with Lewis, I mean, I thought he was incredible. Um, you know, certainly Lehigh tried to press him and, uh, you know, turn him over, and, uh, you know, he, he was aggressive against it and scored a couple goals, drew a couple penalties, uh, you know, and then Vince, you know, at the end of the game, those finishes, the first you know, two out of the first three goals, and, you know, Timmy's just always so solid, so um, I'm sure teams, part of their scouting report is if we can stop those guys that, you know, they'll have a good chance to win the game, and, you know, they, they always respond to it and, and play great and share the ball and get everybody involved and uh you know for my money they're the best attack in the country coach congratulations best of luck to you next week against army okay thank you guys that's ryan Polly, the head coach mm -hmm. of the bu terriers uh, again bu with a 14 to 11 victory over lehigh here as vince dialto set to join us down on the field here at nickerson field three goals and two assists for vince dialto another member of that Long Island Express attack line for Boston University as they got a date with Army next week in the final game of the Patriot League regular season 
as we send it down to the field. Vince D'Alto joins us here. Vince, how important was this win for you guys looking ahead to next week? Yeah, it was a great win. We know that Lehigh is a fantastic team, and we had all week to prepare for them. Um, I can't wait to see them in the playoffs again, and I, um, I, I wish the best of luck to them, and I can't wait to see them again. It was a big win. All right, Vince, how, how are you guys going to beat Army next week? You know, we have to do a lot of preparation. They have some fantastic players. I think they're top, they've been top 10 all year. Um, they have a fantastic, fantastic defense. They have a great goalie. Um, and I'm excited to really play for them and prepare for them. All right, Vince, congratulations on the win. Go enjoy. Best of luck next week. All right, thank you, guys. Great talking to you guys. Vince D'Alto, part of that Long Island Express attack line for BU. They came up big. They win it by three over rival Lehigh here in Boston.